What's up guys, I got this ThinkPad W500 here, and as you can see, it currently has eight gigabytes of RAM in it, which is the maximum amount that you can add to the W500. So RAM is maxed out, but if we take a look at the disk here, the only thing that shows up is SDA, this 57.3 uh, gigabyte disk, which is really the flash drive that I currently have Linux Mint booted off of. So this ThinkPad has no hard drive, no SSD or any onboard storage like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to install this uh, one terabyte solid state drive into it. It's actually really, really easy on the ThinkPad. This is probably the easiest computer to put a hard drive in. So maybe this is less of a tutorial and more of an advertisement for used ThinkPads. All right, so go ahead and disconnect your ThinkPad from the charger and flip it over. And all that we have to do is just remove this one screw from the hard drive bay. Uh, so this is the hard drive bay here on the W500. It should be located on the right-hand side or left-hand side when it's flipped over. Uh, but if you're using a different model, you can usually identify the hard drive bay by this symbol. So it's like, I don't know, a little trash can or a cylinder or something like that. So we just have to take out that one screw and then try to pry this open. It usually helps if you have uh, some fingernails to kind of get in between the crack there. So this can go off to the side. And then um, there's a tray in here that slides out. Um, again, you can try to pry it out with your fingernails, but I'm probably just going to use this um, pry tool here. So it just has a little hook on the end of it and uh, that'll make getting that bay out probably show you guys what it looks like when it's inside the ThinkPad. So that is what we're trying to get out. Actually, this one still has the ribbon intact. So if I can try to just get that out a bit. There we go. And so now I can use that ribbon to just pull out that hard drive bay. So this is the hard drive bay here. Um, we probably don't need any screws to hold the hard drive in place because uh, this thing is pretty sturdy and it's got the uh, rubber on the side, so that should keep it in place. Uh, but to get the drive in, we do have to take this rubber off temporarily. And so I'm gonna try to show you inside the ThinkPad again so that you can see how uh, the drive has to be oriented. So you can see the two uh, different connections there so that you know how the solid state drive has to go in. Let's open this drive up. Okay, and so our drive is going to go in just like that. And look, you can see it is snug as a bug inside of that tray. And it'll be even more snug once we put our sliders on or a little, uh, I'm not sure what you call these, the rubber bumpers or, I don't know, leave a comment down below if you know what these little rubber pieces are called. All right, so we got our drive in, and of course that is the orientation, how it's going to go into the computer. So go ahead and slide it in. Uh, you might have to push it a little bit and kind of wiggle it to get it to line up with the um, SATA connection that's inside on the motherboard. All right, and there we go, I got it in all the way, and you know you're in all the way when uh, you can do this and see your finger through the little screw hole, because if it's not in all the way, the ribbon will be blocking it and you won't be able to close up the computer. Go ahead and put this thing back on, just snaps in like that. Put the screw in. All 
All right, and let's boot this bad boy and show you the drive. All right, and as you can see, our new SDA is this unformatted uh, 931.5 gigabytes uh, disk. So the hard drive is showing up. I could go ahead and, uh, well, really, I could just go ahead and start installing Linux Mint because it's a just works distro. It'll do all the formatting and stuff for me. So, hope you found this useful. Again, probably the easiest computer in the world to put a hard drive in, but it is content nonetheless. Be sure to like and comment to hack the algorithm. Peace out.